Alright, what is up? What is up? I had to do this on the fly. We barely had time to do it. Thank God this thing takes forever. We are in the midst of stuff. The next stage, it's actually the next stage that I care about. I don't really care about this stage. This stage doesn't really matter. But this is, I recently hit infernal mode and I'm mashing my, my buttons in the middle of the screen where there's nothing to hit. Shoutouts to me. Um... The next stage is actually going to be like the big boss man. Well, not the big boss man, but like the second to last big boss man. The second toughest regular not chaos labyrinth boss. And so I was hoping, I mean, I got some actually like high quality people that I'm playing with right now. The uh, green dude is a bot. Oh, two of people, and they're both very good. And these fucking skeletons always piss me off, stupid sorcerers. <laughs> I never remember that they're a goddamn... I never remember that they're, like, allies. Throw that yellow! Throw that yellow! Look at this dude shooting lightning at me and auto block saving my ass. <laughs> auto block was, bar none, the best investment of skill points ever for me, because I like hitting buttons. I don't like holding down a button to block. So thank you, Autoblock, for like saving my ass from looking stupid as hell just countless, countless times. Oh, this homie had a room going. I didn't even know. Oh. I didn't care about that. Oh, God! I didn't even see that there. Thanks, Knight. Not blocking the trap for me. Didn't even see it. I should know the stages by now. Like, I'm on Infernal mode. I've been playing this game for just ages. I've beaten the game with three different characters now? I think? Yeah. The knight, the Amazon, and well, uh, not the knight, the fighter, the Amazon, and the dwarf. I have beaten it with thus far. You'd think I know the stages by now. You'd also think I know the runes by now, but I don't. I know one. I know, uh. Oh, that's not R2. No! Oh well. Hopefully, you didn't get anything good. I know one, and I can't even remember what it is right now. If I saw it, I would know. It's basically, you get a free treasure chest. Well, you get a hidden treasure chest. There's a treasure chest hidden in the room. You activate the rune. It reveals the treasure chest. I don't need any of that. Y'all can go ahead and grab that shit. I'm a good team player. I'm a high quality... I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. I don't know where I am. Oh, is it still not doing anything? Oh, that was him throwing that shit. Damn it, I thought that was the sorceress, man. And apparently a brother can't block that. Apparently a brother can't block that shit. I seriously, I can't see a motherfucking thing. Shooting in oh, it's one of those demon motherfuckers. Sorry, person over there getting eaten. I'm busy. I'm busy killing this asshole. Oh, he just summoned more. What a dick. I have no idea where I am. I don't know what's happening. I'm on fire. 
It's not the best feeling. He put that right on my damn head. He put that right on my damn head, and now I died. Where am I? The fuck am I? Oh my god, I'm getting eaten! Stop it! Stop it! So this is actually the first time I've fought this boss on Infernal Mode. So I've now learned this motherfucker can eat people while also casting spells. He wasn't capable of doing that in any of the other difficulties. So like, that's why I was hella su that's why I was hella surprised when I saw the dude, when I, you know, saw the lightning come down getting hit hitting me because I was told I just saw him eating something I was like oh there's free hits for me I get to blow this dude up nope bosses on inferno mode are different all right so next next we have a fun one this is gonna be the real test of our abilities the very first group actually no I that was that was different the very first group I joined when I took the Amazon online I play I did not take the Amazon I only took the Amazon online once did not take her online again after that experience. Didn't even bother taking the dwarf online. I handled their shit. Getting to, from normal to hard mode. Uh, completely on my lonesome. Didn't even bother with it. But the group that I joined... Oh, shit. My sword! Yay, my sword! But the group that I joined... The very first level I joined was for the, um, the Red Dragon, the boss that we're going to handle right here. Well, hopefully, if they pick it, they might not pick it. Because, honestly, that motherfucker be scary. On Inferno mode, he's probably even scarier. But there's this part of the level, oh god. Oh, that wasn't an attack animation. He was literally frozen. Oh, God! Um. Gotta keep getting sidetracked. There's too much action. Basically, there's this part where you have to wield a shield. Like, he spits out fire. It covers the entire room. You cannot dodge it. Like, you have to take it. But they give you this big-ass shield that you gotta hold, and then it provides an area of effect to fend up thing so another person grabbed it. i was like okay cool just you know chill here wait for this homie and then the person moved with it like they started moving forward <laughs> so like they just walked the shield range out of all of us and we all died i was like oh well so that was the last time i hopped about online before i Got back in here, started doing more Inferno mode stuff. Yo, damn, look at all that food. Give me some food. That motherfucker, AI bitch, right in the fucking saber tooth, stole all my shit. <laughs> stole all the food that was on the ground that I wanted to grab. Alright, so we do I'm going for it. Like, either way, y'all can bail if you want. I'm in this ass. We gonna go do it. I, I should have actually thinking about this I should have made some themed bags some themed equipment sets so one was like purely dragon um like anti fire anti dra do more damage to dra uh, dragon enemies etc etc all that shit but I didn't cuz I'm dumb so that's my bad Fuck is throwing bombs. Goddamn thieves. Oh god. Okay. Please, somebody, don't be a complete dick. And okay, good. Like a hip oh, he stomped. There's me not paying attention. Oh god, I'm gonna land in the fire. I landed in the damn fire. 
I can't see what attacks it's doing! Stupid salamander oil! <laughs> Fuck, I got stomped. I got stomped. I got, I got bit. I got bit. Did I get eaten again? That motherfucker ate me again. I must taste good. You know what, do? I'm getting eaten again. Stop it. <laughs> I don't deserve this. It's okay. I'm gonna eat right in the middle of this fight. I don't even care. Ooh, I got hit. 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 Oh shit! Oh, somebody used an elixir like right after I fucking healed myself. Oh, I'm off in the corner. I'm staring at the wrong damn night. Shoutouts to me. Oh no, I lost my weapon! Fuck that, fuck that. We're equipping our other sword. I just lost the other sword. <laughs> God damn it! I got it back! I'm getting eaten! Where am I? Where am I? I can't see. I can't see! I died. I finally died. I finally died. I was doing so well, and then I completely lie. I mean, it just happens in this game. Like, sometimes you just, you flat out lose track of yourself. And that's what happened there. I lost track of myself. I got blown up. Did I just get stomped? I thought I dodged. Maybe I didn't. I guess I didn't, because I lost my sword. <laughs> Can't even hang on to my own damn sword. Fuck. Oh god, I'm out of my I'm out of mighty potions, I'm out of potions of might of whatever the fuck those are called. I just got my ass swiped. Fuck off. Really? Ow! Damn. That's my good sword too! <laughs> this other one that I have, like this other one I literally have equipped solely so I can do like the ground pound shit because that thing does obscene damage when I do it and so but like doing that shit um oh the, the person just left us the good the good sorceress just left us well we're gonna keep on going we're gonna keep on going to get us a full video actually you know what oh yes let's do this cooking let me show you how godlike let me show you how godlike I am at this mini game I'm gonna feed two of us and I'm gonna show you how godlike I am at this fucking mini game. I'm gonna show you how not godlike I am at this mini game because I can't click on shit online. <sighs> yeah! See, look at this. I'm gonna cook for both of us. Like, Ro is getting some shit. Unfortunately, Benton, Benton isn't getting shit. problem with doing this kind of thing online like you have to it just it takes you have to take a second instead of being able to like do shit immediately you have to take a quick second yo this dude is taking every single spice so i don't know why people do that like honestly i think that's a waste of time i did not mean to take that i wanted the potatoes 
I don't even know if those are actually potatoes. Yeah, see, this dude is taking every single spice, like every you motherfucker. Oops, my bad. I didn't want that. I didn't want that. I didn't want to do that either, but whatever. We're, oh, I didn't even know I had something in there. I don't think I have time for another Well, I definitely don't have time for another one now that I fucking fucked that up. It's so painful online. Damn, Aurora did beat me. Shit. Maybe adding spices to everything does actually help. Like, I've heard people say that that shit, like, does actually help. But until now, until actually the last two people, the last time I cooked with that Benton person, and then now this time, that was the first two times that anybody has ever gotten higher bonuses than me in cooking, and I never use the spices. I never give a shit. Spices are for not manly people. Oh my god! I can't see shit! Do you know your runes? Because I don't know my runes. Hello there, person. That's really weird. Why the fuck that's useless? <laughs> this person doesn't know their runes. <laughs> that shit only heals you up to your max health, and everybody has hella higher than their max fucking health. My sword's gonna break. I see it, bro. My main sword has... Sh this shit has 250 durability. It breaks in, like... I, I swing about five times, and then it breaks. That That's this sword. So I'm just using broken equipment. Well, let's go. Let's go. We activated a rune ability. Let's go somewhere where it's fucking useful. Let's go somewhere where I can change my equipment so my sword isn't broken. I don't look like a scrub. <laughs> Damn, I'm doing no damage. You know what? I would actually probably be doing better damage. Let me just do that shit. <laughs> I am. I'm doing so... Oh, actually, never mind. That was... That we, I forgot that that was the bonus we had. That the bonus we had was the bare-fisted damage. Oh, is something still alive? Oh, these fucking thieves, man. Oh, God! My bad. That was my, that was stupid of I me. Mean, that was just bad. That was all around bad. Yo, why do you keep... Oh, okay, well, never mind. You actually, that... I don't know how she got hit so many times, but she actually needs that. The followers of Yay! Oh, damn, my shield broke, too. <laughs> But that's actually very weird because I just noticed maybe it has to be that way. I mean, maybe that's just the way they coded it. But both times, the same exact uh, level, the same class of person joined in the spot of the person that dropped. Please don't fall off the edge. I always fall off the edge. Guaranteed, at least one time. At least one time, I'm gonna fall off the edge here because I just I'm terrible. I don't pay attention to my surroundings, like I should. I can't even hit this dude. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> what I just get for that dude get one last goddamn spell off? That motherfucker must have gotten one damn less. Damn, look at these people losing their health like crazy. No, don't do it! Don't do it! Whore, don't do it! I got other shit to break. Oh, okay, never mind. We good, we good, we good. Wait, wait, wait. I got it, 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 I got it. I got it. I got us extra points. You're fucking right, I did. Oh, that dude's probably, like, spawning in front of himself. I keep, I'm not even noticing 
that this motherfucker keeps getting that low of health. So he's probably summoning all that shit so he can eat it himself to bring some health back. And here I am, the jackass, stealing it. It's how I do, it's how I do. Bitch. How the hell did I lose my... How the hell did I fall off? I don't know. 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 Oh my god, two of the purple ones at once. Oh my god. Oh my god, these dudes are assholes. But thankfully, the range of my sword swiping stuff is huge, and I can just hit the entire carpet area. Yay. Fighter making everything easier for me, don't actually have to aim. Alright, so this will be the last one. This one's actually very easy, provided this homie, this, uh, what am I trying to say? Provided he has that. That shit is ridiculous. That shit is just legitimately crazy. It does stupid damage. It does a stupid amount of hits. The only problem with it is that it kind of, I mean, obviously it, like, I'll just focus on this head. I got this shit. Look at how long I can stay in the air for. I'm just floating. Floating like a boss. How are you dying? person must be like level 50 or some shit. Like that's the only way I can possibly think of it. Either that or their equipment sucks. But they have a lot of health. Like they have as much base health as I do. Not that I've spent a lot of points upgrading my shit, but still. Ow. See? See? Oh my god, stop it. <laughs> Let a brother up. Look at that, look how little I care. I should've cared. I wonder if people have realized yet, because I found out, there's certain parts of the body that like, oh God. There are certain parts of the body that, like, it'll show you doing damage to them, but you won't actually be, like, affecting the health bar at all. See, like, right there when I was slashing away at the goat head and the snake head? Like, you saw the numbers coming up, like, I was doing damage, but I wasn't actually damaged. Like, the health bar wasn't going down at all. So, like, I think once they get to, like, a certain point of damage, the, like, the further hits on them just don't matter anymore. Fuck! I mean, as far as I'm aware, the lion head part is, like, always vulnerable. You can always hit that. You can always do damage to it. But the goat head and the snake head... Actually, I guess for a chimera... The, isn't the snake the tail usually for a chimera, as far as I'm aware? Anyway. Um... Um... What am I trying to say? Yeah, I don't think you can continue, I don't think you can do damage to them all the time, constantly. I think at a certain point of damage, they stop actually taking. They'll still show you doing damage for some reason, but you'll you won't actually be hurting them. I don't know. Maybe I'm just hallucinating that, and I'm just crazy. I don't know. I hate this. I hate this. Stop giving me equipment above the level I can equip it. Just give me shit that I can fucking use. 
the other thing that you're probably also going to see that's going to ooh, it's gonna piss me off. I'm gonna get like some I'm gonna get some fucking S ranked item. I'm gonna get some goddamn S ranked item. And it's gonna be for a class that is not my own. Really? All the shields are be fuck you. <laughs> I need more shields. Like that's the thing that I need the most is shields. I mean I need other stuff, but shields are like the main thing. Shields are the main thing. I don't even bother with equipment that is below A rank anymore, though. I have a superiority complex. See, let's see. Well, so far, only A rank. Oh, okay, well, that wasn't bad. I didn't get an S rank stuff. But the worst is when you're playing a low-level character. Because I only just started playing this dude again. I played, like I said, I played through as Dwarf and Amazon to get the achieve or the uh, trophies for beating them, beating the game with them on normal mode. And it pisses me off so much because you really need equipment then. Like, you really, really need equipment. Um, as... When you're a low, when you're a low level and trying to build up, you need solid equipment because it's very rare to get A or S rank chests. Oh my god, it was agonizing. Every single time you see S rank and you go looking for the item and it's a weapon for another class. Or it's a shield for another, like it's a shield or a piece of armor for another class. It's depressing. Cause I don't, I don't bother keeping any of the stuff that's for other classes because like, it's either gonna be like if for, if it's something for my fighter, it's way too low of a level to matter. Or alternatively, by the time I get there, when I'm actually playing that character myself, it's gonna be irrelevant anyway because I'm gonna have gotten plenty of good equipment for them by that time anyway. So who cares? It's just depressing. It's just I need to set up the rest of my bags too. Like I kind of have it. I kind of started doing some uniform stuff here, like healing stuff. Shortcut to X, power up stuff to uh, triangle, thing that I never use to circle. I have not used that once ever because I never remember it. And then I have a second weapon for when I lose the other weapon because I lose the other weapon a lot. And I need this, I think I only have four bags set up that way and the rest of them are just like, yeah, yeah, I kind of don't really care. <laughs> Especially this one. We really don't care about that one. We still have the fucking original shield on that one. That's why I need more shields. They're killing me. They're killing me. So I hope you enjoyed that. Hope you enjoyed a little bit of red dragon fun. Because that bother... Actually, the boss that gives me the most fits... Well, it used to. I kind of... It was because I wasn't being smart about it. I wasn't, like, reacting to stuff and dodging as I should have been. It was, it was because I was just playing like an idiot basically but the thing that was giving me the most trouble was actually the killer rabbit the killer rabbit was murdering my face constantly but then i started playing through solo with the amazon and the dwarf like i just played alone just to kind of like get a feel for them and also try to improve myself and get like get a look at how everything works how everything moves how everything how all their attacks work and stuff so i can properly react to them and so i've gotten a lot better because of that whereas when i was playing as the fighter i was literally just that's all I did. That was that was the extent of of my my play. This is what I did. And occasionally I would move forward to do the slash. And occasionally I would do that to move forward to the stage. And that was basically it. I didn't really pay attention to anything. <laughs> so I'm getting better. The killer rabbit's actually not that bad now that I actually dodged out of the way of its attacks. Um but the killer rabbit was the one that gave me the most fits. Killed me. Just murdered me. It sucked. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I doubt you're going to see any kind of special, like, hey, look at me, I soloed the final boss by myself because I'm awesome. That was kind of redundant. Soloed by myself, that's kind of the definition of solo, buddy. Anyway, because I'm not that good. I might do, I'm like, honestly, if I level up, like, the Amazon or the Dwarf or something, I might do it because the Amazon is just a fucking monster. The Amazon is scary. And the Dwarf, I just have, like, a really awesome kind of build idea for it that might work out for just like hilariously excellent burst damage that could just murder its face but i don't know i don't have that with the knight i just i just do stuff with the knight so peace out